Your Honor, I don't consent to being talked to in that fashion. Your lack of consent is noted for the record. Please find the piece of paper, open it up, and please read it. I will not consent to that, Your Honor. Where do I agree to that, Your Honor? I do not. Mr. Brooks, then I'm going to advise the Sheriff's Department to find the piece of paper and hand it to me so that I can read it. And so that those are your two options. What would be the basis for that, Your Honor? Mr. Brooks, this is an issue that you raised, and I need to bring it to finality and know what the test result is. Okay, with all due respect, it was uh, a motion that I raised. All right, um, I'm going to clear the courtroom. We're going to go off the record, and uh, we're going to find that piece of paper, and I'm going to address it when that's done. Um, I needed to make a record of what was being done, uh, including that I have obtained the test result, uh, so that there's an accurate record in this case uh, related to the motion that was raised previously by uh, Mr. Brooks. I want Mr. Brooks to know that I am not um, removing him from uh, when the jurors are brought back in. It was just simply because he was upset. Um, he was um, very loud when I walked into the courtroom before going on uh, back on the record. Um, he was uh, yelling about his constitutional rights being violated. Um, I advised him that if there was any type of use of force that he wanted to complain about, he could certainly do that through the proper channels uh, with the sheriff's department. But just given his state of agitation and my need to make a record, um, I had him taken to the other courtroom. He is currently muted. I do not intend to go forward uh, with additional testimony. Ultimately, I'm going to take an early lunch break because of this. Um, but I will make a record of the following. I have the result. Um, I am going to scan it, have my clerk scan it. It will be filed as confidential, though. It won't be available to the public. Uh, but I, it's there for appellate purposes. But I can confirm that the test result for COVID-19 was negative. And again, I required uh, the Sheriff's Department to provide that result to me. Um, and it was, and it will remain under seal. I realize I'm disclosing that result, but I feel obligated to do that given the motion that was raised two days ago by uh, Mr. Brooks.